Hey everyone, it's James Lambert, the international speaker, author, coach and positive transformational speaker. I went from knockouts to knowledge and from headlocks to hugs. I still embrace people, just now in a more positive way. So hello to you, I hope you're thriving in all areas of life. And you're doing very, very well indeed in every area. So, in this video, I wanted to share another beautiful piece of writing from Paolo Coelho's great book, Manual of the Warrior of Light. See what you think of this one. I repeat, you can recognise a warrior of light by the look in his eye. Warriors of light are in the world, they form part of the world and they were sent into the world without saddlebags or sandals. They are often cowardly, they do not always act correctly. Warriors of light are wounded by the most foolish things, they worry about trivialities, they believe themselves incapable of growing. Warriors of light sometimes believe themselves unworthy of any blessing or miracle. Warriors of light often ask themselves what they are doing here. Often they find their lives meaningless. That is why they are warriors of light, because they fail, because they ask questions, because they keep looking for a meaning and in the end they will find it. Beautiful, awesome passage again as always. I love that. Precisely we're warriors of light because we fail. I call it failing forward. Fail towards your destiny. Get them out of the way. So many people are inhibited by the fear of failure. So they don't do anything. So yeah, they might not have failed, but they've remained the same, stuck, static, going nowhere. If anything, regressing. If a muscle isn't worked, it doesn't remain the same, it atrophies, it gets weaker. Likewise with us. So great ways to fail, get them out of the way. Because very much like fear, you realise what was there to be afraid of. Moreover, you learn. As I'm so often, uh, often faith, um, enjoy saying, some you win, some you learn. It still begins with an L, but it's not a loss. It's not a loss if it propels you, you know, gets it's forward, gets you wiser, gets you more knowledgeable. So you're, you're tweaking all along, you're readjusting and improving on yourself. So don't be afraid to fail. Don't you dare be afraid to fail. And also because they ask questions. I was always told a real wise person ask questions. Again, you may be afraid, fear of failure in the classroom to start, oh, don't put your hand up if you don't know. So only, so it is, it is reverse engineering, it's backward thinking. So, you know, if, if, you, if, if I knew the answer, I wouldn't need to put my hand up, but that's bold, asking questions. Asking questions, what does it mean? What could it mean? Are there other ways to do it? That is how you improve. That's how I've improved my life, asking questions. Is there a better way to act? Is, do I just have to accept my anger or can I work on it? Can I defeat it? And I found, yes, yes, you can. Can you become happier, more peaceful, more content? Yes, keep asking questions. Questions truly are a pathway, not only to joy and happiness, but profound wisdom, profound wisdom. Not knowledge, that can come from books, but wisdom, that's the integration of knowledge into your actual life. So it helps you, your community, and the world at one. Because they keep looking for a meaning. That's so important in my own life. Is this it? Washing pots and pans, as a kitchen porter, labouring on site, fighting, working as a bouncer. No judgement, but that just wasn't me. That was not me, so I kept on looking for a meaning. Kept on looking for a meaning. I'm here to serve, I'm here to love. And so therefore I look for vehicles to do that. And you can do the same, my friend. You know, you can look for meaning. And you know what? In the end, they will find it. You will find it. So keep searching. Keep asking questions. Dare to fail. Dare to dream. Keep looking for a meaning. And in the end, you will find it. And I don't know what could be any more hopeful than that. So from my heart to yours, much, much love. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please do share it now. 
I really, I, I'm so thankful for those of you, there's a dedicated few that religiously watch my videos and comment, and I'm so thankful for you, but to impact others for, for the better, I would so appreciate if you could share it on your social media, whatever you're on, even if it's just the one platform, Facebook, or you've got multiple, Twitter, maybe elsewhere, I am so appreciative because I really am about building a tribe of like-minded, positive individuals that are going about life positively, stretching themselves, failing forwards, and going for their dreams. So as always, thank you for your time and attention, and know this, that you, yes you, are unstoppable, and I believe in you. Take care.